All right, the directions for these problems say to answer the following with always, sometimes, or never true. Okay, so we have six problems here. Let's, let's kind of go through them one by one and see if they are always, sometimes, or never true. The first one, a square is a parallelogram. All right, so think about a square. Is that always a parallelogram? Is it only sometimes a parallelogram? And it's always a parallelogram, right? You can't have a square and say that it's not a parallelogram ever. So this has to be always true. All right, the next one says a rhombus is a rectangle. All right, and if you think about it, remember back when we talked about squares? Squares were kind of the overlapping of a rhombus and a uh, rectangle. And so since that's true for a square, uh, this is gonna be just sometimes true. It's only true when it is a square. So just sometimes true. Okay, next one says a rectangle is a parallelogram. Well, kind of like the, uh, the first one, a square is a parallelogram. This is always true, okay? You can't have a rectangle and say it's not a parallelogram. All right, our next column over here says a square is a rectangle. This is always true, okay? Remember a square, the definition is that it's both a rectangle and a rhombus. So a square is always going to be a rectangle. Okay, next one says a parallelogram is a rhombus. Sometimes, right? Um, but you can have a parallelogram that's not a rhombus. So this is only sometimes true when all the sides are the same. All right, and this last one here says a rectangle is a square. This one's only sometimes true. It's only true when it's also a rhombus, all right? So if a rectangle has all of its sides the same, as well as all the properties of the rectangle that it currently has, then it will be a square, okay? So again, this one's only sometimes true. All right, guys, hopefully you found this video helpful. Um, if these were hard for you, or if you wanna check out more rectangle, rhombus, and square problems, uh, look at this video where I go over some of those different properties in rectangles, rhombuses, and squares.